Okay, so today we're going to add windows and lights to our buildings. Um, we've got lots of fun materials. We've got gel markers and silver sharpies. We've also got some metallic oil pastels. So you guys are super lucky because you've got some really cool things to use. I'm sure there's some other stuff in the classroom that will work on our black paper, but I picked some of the coolest stuff um, for everyone to use. So when we're making our windows, we want to think about different shapes that we can use. Um, they don't have to look like real windows. We could do heart-shaped windows or circular windows or really whatever you want. So a ruler is going to help us. Um, it's going to help us keep our windows in nice even rows. And so we're just going to start off and do this building first. Okay, so I have to decide what shape I want my windows. I'll start with some straight line windows because I have this nice ruler. So I'm just using the ruler to make nice straight lines and scooting it up the page just a little bit. I tried really hard to keep my lines parallel and to keep them all the same length and I'm happy with that. I think I did a good job. So now I'll move over to a building on the other side maybe while I have this silver sharpie and I'll go ahead and put some windows in one of these buildings. I think I'll use dots this time and I'll use the marks on my ruler to make sure that all my dots are spaced equally. Scoot my ruler up and do the next row of dots. Wow. So by using my ruler, I had one little mess up spot I'm not really happy with, but other than that, I think it looks really, really good. So I'll put the Sharpie down and I'll go ahead and try one of the gel markers. So they sometimes take just a minute to show up, but usually they work really, really well on black paper. So let's come to this middle building and maybe I will do some squares in this building. So I'm going to do a couple of squares, maybe two squares, and then maybe a circle in the middle. And then two squares. Okay, so those are so cool because they take a minute to show up, but it's almost like magic. You can see them show up right before your eyes. So I did a cool pattern there, which I like because it's different from the other buildings. Looks good whenever you use variety. another gel marker now. So I think that's pretty cool. It's not exactly a pattern, but it's just a different combination of windows put together and on here all together. I think it looks really neat. I'll try some oil pastels now. Some of the main things are we want some variety where we have different styles of windows and different buildings. We want some nice neat rows where you can tell where the different floors on the buildings are and it doesn't just look random. It looks like you planned it. And I want to see a variety of materials used too. So I want you to try out some of the different cool things we have. And if you have another idea of something you think might work, then feel free. All right, I want everyone to use their rulers and their creative brains and come up with some really cool styles of windows to share with your friends. All right, good luck. Mm -hmm. 